guys welcome back to another vlog i have quite an exciting day planned for today so i thought i would take you guys with me i say with me we're not actually going out obviously we're still in quarantine the uk is still very much in lockdown i have some stuff planned inside that are super fun and super creative and i wanted to show you guys a little bit of what i get up to like on a normal day oh my god the window is open so if you're here only for sure if you hear motorbikes cars children anything that's because you're right next to a window i've got a fun day planned inside i am doing a makeup look i am doing some emails instagram stuff filming a video um a really exciting video that i've had planned for a while so let's start the vlog i have just got my coffee here i'm in my harry potter pajamas actually this is a nighty and it's so comfy makeup look i want to create for today is something along the lines of this it's like mask makeup like illusion makeup that's the lines i want to go across i'm really excited i feel like it's going to take me a while i know nikki tutorials did a video on it a while ago but i feel like the message i've got behind is really good and it really like sticks with me and i'm really excited to do it and to put it out there on the internet i recently did an instagram post oh my god guys i literally could not believe this post i hit 1000 likes on it yesterday it's one Oh my God, guys, the number of times it was shared blew my absolute mind and I just got so much love on it. So thank you so much. And if you haven't seen it, go and check it out because it's all about Instagram and being a creator and not letting your follower define you, which I think is so, so, so important. I have a vlog scheduled for tonight. This one here. Picnics and PR packages. That's what we're at. I'm going to start with the makeup look because it's going to take me a while a while yes i'm filming it this time because I felt like maybe i'll do like a video and show you behind the scenes of what i get up to and how long it actually takes me to create these makeup looks because it takes me a while let's just crack on with it and have a good day that is the finished look i mean i look like i've still got like pill on my nose but it's fine what do you guys think i love it i think it looks sick obviously i need to like hold it and stuff so i'm just gonna take an instagram and then literally going to take this off that is literally what happens but 
to sort that out. But yeah, this is basically the finished look. I love it. I'm obsessed. I think it turned out really good. Um, I'm going to... The only thing is I found it really hard to blend the brown. Um, it looks okay around here, but then as soon as you come around here, it looks really dark. But that's fine. I can always edit that if I need to. But yeah, I'm just literally going to take some Instagrams. I will leave the Instagram that I take here. Um, and then film some Instagram stories and then literally take it off. That's what happened. I just want to show you the reality of what it's like when I do my makeup looks on Instagram, of what it looks like. That is literally what it looks like every single time. Have my laptop out as I normally am watching something. I normally have like free coffee, some water, um, two mirrors and all my brushes and everything just sprawled out. And then this... This is how I take my Instagram photos, especially for like a colourful makeup looks. I like, there's a ring light here, another tripod and a sheet. And then I'm just going to set up this tripod that I'm on now down there looking at that so I can get a good makeup shot. And um, there's nothing like in the background to take away from like the face, if that makes sense. So that's basically what I'm going to do now. I've taken my makeup off. I've still got a little bit under my eye here. So I'm going to go downstairs, wash my face, and make some lunch because I haven't actually eaten and it's like one o'clock. Um, and then come back up, redo my makeup because I've got a YouTube video to film, emails, Instagram stories, um, Instagram comments. I've got, I think I've got fluff around my nose somewhere. Everything to do. So I'm going to go downstairs, make some lunch, come back up, get ready. And then we're going to crack on with actually doing stuff. I've washed my face. I've still got the tiniest bit of um, eyelash glue under my eyes that I need to get off. It's just been stubborn. But I've just made myself a wrap. It has a veggie burger in, cheese and hummus. So, so good. Mm, 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 mm. Does anyone else dance when they see food or when they have food? Just get a bit excited, don't you? Do you know what I mean? Or is it just me? Probs just me. Just get ready really quickly for a video as I'm about to film my Insta Instagram followers. Instagram followers send me their unpopular opinions or something like that. I don't know. That's what the video is. I need to film that and then I need to get on to doing emails and everything like that. I feel like I've done the day very backwards today. I should have started with emails and Instagram comments, then done the video, and then done the makeup. But I've done it backwards. That's just where I work. I've just come out to my hallway, hence the echo. But yeah, I've just um, done my makeup now, ready to film a video. I'm just going to put on the kettle, make myself a tea. And then we're ready to go and film. I just quickly did my makeup. I say quickly. It was quickly, was it? Mm, probably not though. Then we're gonna film a video. So that's what we're doing now. Right, so I have very kindly been sent some products from the company Enspa. Now you may have seen them in um, Asda. That's where I tend to see this brand, Asda and Boots. They very kindly sent me some stuff. So I want to show you what they have sent me. Thank you so much to the team at Enspa. Lee and George, thank you so much for sending me these products. I want to show you what I've been sent. Very luxurious, very fancy, and I cannot wait. Let me start with this product here. I've got the product out and the packaging so we can see what they both look like. So we've got Enspa. Oh, also, all of these products, I believe, belong to the first signs of aging range. I don't necessarily think there's any problem with people incorporating, like, first signs of aging skincare into your routine because the earlier you do it I feel like the better it will help you in the long run the first product is daily complexion perfecting cream it says plump and reduce fine lines and wrinkles for a visibly smooth up complexion that's the packaging of the box like this pattern here it's really funky and it reflects really nicely and then this is the actual product very fancy very luxe and I just think it looks so nice on your bedside table, obviously with the lid on. This is this is 50 ml. That's the packaging and the product together. Then we have the eye cream. It says daily perfecting eye cream, plump and reduce crow's feet for a visibly smoother complexion. So that is the little box there. Cutest little product. <laughs> 
Oh my god, guys, look how cute that is. Look, can you imagine how cute that would look up there? I creamed it last you the longest time, so I don't necessarily think that they need to be big. So this size is kind of perfect. This is 15 mil. Daily Perfecting Serum. Plump and reduce crow's feet wrinkles in five minutes. This is the product. Does that look like a toothbrush to you or is it me? It looks really fun. The packaging's super cool, super different to anything I've seen before. It's going to be really nice to use. It looks really fun. This is like the applicator. So I'm guessing just around there. Bob's your uncle and the rest is history. Love that. So thank you so much to the lovely team over at Enspa from Lee Publicity. I really am looking forward to trying these products. And Lee and George, you are absolute babes. So thank you so, so, so much. So I've taken my lashes off because oh, they always weigh my eyes down a lot. And now my makeup looks so shoddy. I've got such a leaky eye at the moment, guys. I think it's all to do with like hay fever and stuff. Then I'm just having a quick chill. And then, yeah. I'm just gonna reply back to some Instagram comments. It's so annoying because I don't know if anyone else has it. Please tell me if you do. You're about to hit a milestone. You're so close. Ah, <sighs> and then people like unfollow you, like 20 people. So it's really annoying. I'm so close to 9k, and I really want to hit it. Um, my followers have just gone all the way back down. So it is what it is. It happens to everyone. Popping out with my sister real quick and I thought I'd just put the camera on and just record change of scenery from my bedroom but yeah we're just quickly popping out it's super sunny and there are bad people on the road that don't know how to drive let me just put it that way just taking my makeup off it's proving to be an absolute struggle but we're getting there i do my nighttime skincare routine i don't think this angle is flattering or whatsoever my makeup off using this nivea sensitive three in one micellar water for sensitive skin i have sensitive skin and this is currently like burning my face so it can't be that good. I'm only using it because I need to use it up and more one. So I'm going in with this Elemis Rehydrating Ginseng Toner. Staple in my skincare routine. I'm obsessed with it. Just literally gets off all of the extra makeup and also balances my skin out. The pH balance, shall we say. Extra makeup, gross. We don't know her. It is currently half ten. Cute. Scroll down. Just Four com comments. I'm going to reply back to these right now. Going to end this vlog here. Thank you so much for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe. Please come and follow me over on my Instagram. Listen to my podcast. Follow me on Twitter. All the good stuff. Just come over, interact, say hello. I will be sure to interact back. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.